This guide shows you how to view and delete your history in Microsoft Edge. Microsoft Edge is the new browser that's only included with Windows 10. Open up Microsoft Edge as you normally would. Once it's open, you can view the history by clicking on these three vertical lines here. Left click it once, a menu appears. Now move your mouse over the clock with the arrow pointing anti-clockwise and left click once. As you can see, a list of websites has appeared. You can also see websites that you might have viewed from last week by clicking on the arrow next to last week and websites that are older than a week or last week by clicking on the arrow next to older. And this shows you other websites that you've visited. To clear the history, once we're in here, all we do is we left click once on clear all history. It then asks us what browser browsing history do we want to clear so all we do is we we can just leave the three boxes ticked as they are but if we want to clear more like the download history form data and passwords we can left click the boxes next to each one of these to clear it likewise if we don't want to clear a certain thing again we can left click the box beside each each uh, section we don't want to clear and that will remove the tick so for example if I didn't want to clear the cookies and save website data I left click once the tick next to cookies and save website data and now it won't clear that that particular part of inf the information but I do want to clear it so I'm going to tick the box next to it once we've ticked all the boxes we want to tick and untick the boxes we don't want to tick, then we can click on clear. But I've just noticed here there's a show more. Let's just click on that and see what's under there. So under show more, we've, we can also clear media licenses, pop-up exceptions, location permissions, full screen permissions and compatibility commission, permissions. Um, I'll leave those unticked as they're, they're not ticked by default. So let's close that up by clicking on the arrow there and then we'll just click clear. OK, once the clear button is no longer greyed out, that's, that should mean that the browsing data has all been cleared. So I'm just going to come out of that. So I'm just going to click away from the clear browsing data box, which will remove it. OK, I'll click on the three horizontal lines again just to check, just to make sure that the history has been deleted. Left click that. And as you can see, under history, you'll see browsing history here once you've visited sites. If you get something else come up like favourites or reading list, then click on the, um, the picture of the clock with the arrow pointing anti-clockwise and that will show you a list of your history. Once you've finished viewing the history, it's probably good practice to, uh, to click on the star to take you back to the default to show any favourites that you might have in Edge. Once you've finished here, just click away from the uh, favourites box and that will disappear and you can carry on browsing in Edge.